This is the final stage of infection, called ascent. Drasophila climbs to a higher ground. At the command of its host, it spews a sticky substance from its mouthparts, which glues it to the surface. Then comes the command to raise its wings. The fly obeys and freezes in disposition forever, so that the spores of the fungus Entomophthora muscaria, which it is infected with, can spread more effectively, begins to grow from its abdomen. A white spongy fungus, or rather its spore-bearing organs, they appear between the chitinous plates, and literally shoot out microscopic spores. The photo shows the radius of the spread of those very spores that should fall on healthy flies. The entire body of the sick fly is already filled with mycelium. Scientists have discovered that infected flies die at sunset in a cool part of the barn. This temperature is favorable for the fungus. In the morning, when the first rays of the sun begin, to warm this place, live flies flock there to warm up. By that time, the fungus had already managed to throw out spores at night. And in the morning they began to form secondary spores, infecting new flies that were nearby. The fungus somehow takes into account the behavior of other flies in the time of day. Reproduce more effectively. And the bodies of an infected dead female attract healthy males. They fly in and try to mate with the infected one. The ladies, whose immobility is interpreted as consent, immediately become infected themselves, whether this is the work of the fungus or the natural behavior of flies is still unclear. The manipulative effect on insects is similar to cardiceps. But this flu prefers to parasitize on flies. So scientists are looking for ways to use entumphtora to fight insects. But so far its spores are too fragile and quickly lose viability. Now they are actively researching. They are working to make these spores stronger and more resistant and turn the flu into a biological weapon against pests. Just imagine how cool it would be. Instead of harmful chemicals, a resilient modified deadly flu that can reproduce itself, penetrate the body, control the behavior of animals and ultimately exterminate them. Okay, stop.